How's it going? If you don't know me, my name is Mike Carluch, and I help people stand out from the herd of sheep on social media and instead be that eagle that is flying in the other direction, going towards the gold, doing the opposite of what everybody else is doing. And what everybody else is doing right now is using language in their videos to speak to their audience, to sound smart, being way too complex in their videos and not allowing their audience to understand it. They're not meeting their audience where they are at. And therefore, that audience is looking for another person to go to in your market. And you can be that one person that solves the problem in your industry and swoops up all of that viewership. Now, before we get started, I want to bring up something. If you could have seven assets that literally sell for you for the rest of your life on social media, meaning until Elon Musk does some alien stuff and blows up the internet forever and nobody can use it anymore, those seven assets are selling for you forever. If you want something like that, go to 7.luchimedia.com and I got a good offer for you on that page that I think you'll really like. Okay, so let's talk about metaphors. How can we use metaphors to paint a picture in our audience's mind and also get them to understand complex things that they might not understand? Now, let me give you an example. One of the things that I believe in wholeheartedly with social media is that you need to give your audience a point A and a point B. You need to give them a straight process to where they need to get to in every single thing that you post because because if you don't, then they're just going to get overwhelmed and they're not going to keep coming back to your page because they never get anything actionable out of it. And here's a tweet that I made to make that whole concept easier to understand in a metaphor. So I said, in your social media videos, you are a doctor. You are diagnosing the problem your audience has and then providing them an exact prescription. You see how that kind of like paints a picture in your mind. Like, okay, yeah, that makes sense. I want to be a doctor on social media and I am diagnosing my audience with a problem and then providing them a prescription. Not only does it paint a picture in their mind, but it also makes it very easy for them to understand. And just saying it in that different way could cause them to have a breakthrough. Like somebody else might've told them the same thing in a very complex way that they didn't understand. But when I said that, all of a sudden they're like, whoa, that makes sense. And now I'm going to go and do it. So that's literally a way that you can stand out. Look at all of the complex things that are in your market that most people would not understand. Look at the way that people are saying them. Instead of saying it the same exact way as everybody else in your market, think about metaphors that you can add to those complex topics that would make it easier for your viewer to picture things just like this doctor and prescription thing. Because if you can be the one that's all Always giving people these breakthroughs on social media, you are going to get the viewership, not everybody else in your market. So I hope I really communicated the importance of metaphors and how they can be so powerful in your social media strategy. So take that and run with it. Have a good one.